Do you want to know the real reason why I don't go outside? This is the real reason why I don't go outside. Um, yeah, it's um, just a uh, just a brown block on my chest. Hi guys, and also hi to all the new people. I guess as of right now, we are almost at 400 subscribers. Uh, thank you. That's crazy. Today, I'm just going to be telling a story time. I really got to start doing some more creative than story times because I don't want this channel to become a story time channel. It is so hot. I'm going to sweat right now. I have noticed that people are now doing, well, I guess now. I mean, like, is it too early to start now? Um, but people are doing like back to school videos. I guess like they're doing like, you know, hacks or tips or baby be nee 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 nee. No, I don't I don't have a hack or a tip because I didn't care too much for school. Not like I didn't care. I did care. I mean, I did graduate with all A's and B's, but I didn't go to college. Um uh, this isn't good, is it? I'm just gonna tell like a story time of what happened when I was a little old Sarah in little old fourth grade and it wasn't really good uh I feel like low-key bad about it I say low-key because like come to find out that what happened to the person he didn't really he cared but he didn't care but he kind of cared no he cared it was weird let me just get on to the story before I just ramble on forever in the fourth grade at this moment I lived in New York. I lived in Long Island. Yeah, I lived in Long Island and I have no idea what this school name was. No, zero idea what this school name was. All I know is that on the on the campus lot it was an elementary school, a middle school, and I think not 100 sure but i think it was also a high school all on the same lot so basically if you went to that school then those are the other schools you're gonna go to you're gonna be set you know whatever no idea no idea um what the school was if by any slim chance anyone that lives on or well, lives in or on probably on well lives in long island new york and can maybe tell me if there is a school that's like that, it either has an elementary school, middle school, and a high school, or just an elementary and a middle school on campus. Just leave down the name, maybe it could ring a bell, but to my fourth grade knowledge, I had no idea what the name of the school was, but I went to a school like that, and I'm assuming that the school had money, okay, money. Thinking like when I was little, I didn't really think too much about it until we had computer class. When we had compu computer class, the computer teacher, she came in with a cart and inside that cart, each of us were assigned. Okay, a MacBook. What kind of rich school is this? And I went to public school. What? Why are we assigned MacBooks? What's going on? Like y'all got money just to be assigning people MacBooks? Like, what? What? Like, it was so crazy. Kind of like low key enrolled into that school like maybe a month after the school year started. Or I, I just know that like I was technically the typical new girl, not like oh I've never been to school and this is starting no I was like the new girl I was always a new girl like basically my entire life and also I do remember and people probably will not believe me I remember that in our garden because we had this gorgeous garden and there was koi fish in it koi fish everybody knows how koi how expensive koi fish are I mean they do range of prices but koi fish what anyways that's not the point of the story at this school I had a crush on not one but two boys I mean it was kind of cute one of them was white one of them was I think he was black um I think I don't know we were like the same skin tone I mean like if you're like the same skin tone as me I'm like to say hey like you black whatever we're not getting into that but um I had a crush on two boys um the white boy I know his name was Eric the other boy I don't remember his name because I literally always called him my mini Chris Brown 
on this particular day it was computer day so we all had our macbooks that were doing like a project on like sea animals i'm not 100 sure but we had to do research on something i don't even think i did the actual project to be honest with you um and i sat at the our tables were put into groups I sat kind of like at the head of the group which was weird and there was like uh, four there was two tables on this side two tables on this side so we were all together and I think there was another one at the end but I'm not 100% sure no I don't think so no that no there wasn't because that wouldn't make sense right right we're all just sitting there and then I think we had like dividers so we could cover up our laptops too I don't know why like who cares um so this one day I don't remember who was helping the teacher like uh pass out the macbooks but the teacher was like pass out the macbooks and stuff like that and um eric he sits at the desk that's like right in front of me on my left side yeah i don't know he's like sitting right there and um it's not like i've never talked to him because i've talked to him like a lot obviously we sit at the same table group plus he's like cute and i'm like oh my gosh oh obviously he talks to the group of friends that i have so um me and him i don't know what happened but i think he was saying something that was annoying me so much i don't know what was wrong with me that day what did he say i i have no idea what he said to be honest no idea but all i do remember is that i had a pencil in my hand and i said keep saying that and i'm gonna throw this pencil at your eye so he kept saying whatever in the world he was saying so I threw the pencil. So you know when you throw a pencil sometimes, you know, does a little um, this thing and it probably hits you kind of like eh, or like the eraser hits eh, or like it hits you like eh, 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 eh. Well, I have no idea what was up with my aim that day, but it was immaculate and the lead stabbed him right in the eye. I stabbed my crush in the eye with a pencil. Oh God. Wow, thinking about that now, it just sounds 10 times worse. Wow, it was wow. Like literally the lead part hit him in the eye and it wasn't even, it, cause I was like really close to him. So it was like blunt force in his eye. There was like some screaming and some crying. I don't know what I did. I don't even remember saying sorry, to be honest. What did he say? Damn, why was I so, am I okay? Am I okay? I think the teacher the computer teacher came i have no idea where was my fourth grade teacher at to be honest where was she i don't think she was in the classroom to be honest i think the computer teacher came and was like trying to help him i think he's crying i'm like low-key scared but at the same time just like i kind of don't give a fuck because he was annoying me i didn't say i don't give a fuck obviously i'm in fourth grade i'm just like he shouldn't have said that I don't I really I want to know what happened that day it probably wasn't even that serious I just wanted to hmm I have problems but to make this confusing part uh it's over because I don't even remember your girl didn't get in trouble I don't know how I did not get sent to the principal's office how I did not get a call home no one said anything it, like I just I literally just threw a pencil dead in the in someone's eye and I didn't get in trouble at all um I don't even remember him going to the nurse to be honest but I knew at that at that moment um I knew he did not like me so my crush for him was like ah that's over cuz I fucked that one up didn't I huh ah. kind of thought he got over it uh but because we didn't have like computer day like every day we had obviously not every day but we had like uh i think computer day once a week so i think we didn't have it the week after the incident i think we had it the week two weeks later and um i guess he it was his turn to help like the computer teacher with something and me and him are still sitting at the same table we're still like talking and stuff like that so i guess i guess me thinking like oh we're just over this to be honest right i guess the computer teacher asks him something about like I think um, something with the computers and stuff like that. He was like, oh yeah, no, don't you remember? Because Sarah threw that pencil at my eye and I'm literally thinking in my head, aren't you? We ain't over this? We ain't over this? Just shut up about it, okay? Because I still low-key had a crush on him. But it's like, 
just get over it. Everyone makes mistakes, okay? Maybe if you wouldn't say what you said, then I wouldn't throw the pencil at you. I want to know. He said, why did it, it happened so fast too. Oh. So, so last the time I uh, threw a pencil in my crush's eye in the fourth grade. Um, I have uh, quite a bit of stories from the fourth grade. Uh, fourth grade was actually pretty interesting. Also, fun fact, I actually never finished the fourth grade. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed that little school video. Um, I would have done, done, I would have done, wow. I would have done something more creative, but it's so hot and I can't really think of anything creative. Also, I'm doing a whole bunch of other stuff uh, that takes up my time. Like right now, I'm supposed to be learning a script and I'm filming a video. <laughs> I mean, I could just tell stories about like me in school. I wasn't really a bad child, but um, I'm low key just like trying to figure out how did I graduate school again? Um, If you like this video, please give it a like because likes apparently helps out YouTubers a lot. And I didn't really know that until like not too long ago. I was like, oh, okay. Also comment down below if um, you had a similar experience. If you threw a pencil at someone's eye. I don't, I don't know. Or comment down below a crazy thing you did in elementary school and also if you know a school like that in Long Island please do because I want to know wow I'm shaking this very violently also subscribe if you haven't already because we're trying to get this channel up to 500 subscribers by the end of the year and I think it'd be pretty cool if we can make that happen I mean we's already almost at 400 like her matter her matter yeah and um, also if you notice that this video is like real late uh, I'm sorry it's hot. I'm gonna go. Okay. Bye. Zoe, you gonna say bye? Let's go do that. Come over here. You gotta come over here. Okay. Okay. You gotta tell people bye. Tell them 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 bye. No, can't. Okay. No fucks. Okay. Bye, y'all.